Hi learners, welcome to my channel Data Science University with MLV Prasad. The agenda for today's video is Project 2 Panda Sleet Code Question Type Easy 1303 uh, one, Find the Team Size. The GitHub link for the solution is provided in the description below. You can join my Telegram and LinkedIn page communities for further updates and discussions. Scan here to join the communities. The links are also provided in the video description. Now let's solve together the problem. Okay, they have given some employee table where an employee and his belonging to which team it has been given. Now what they have asked? Write a solution to find the team size of each of the employees. Okay, let me copy it here. So let us see this one. Okay. We can see that the one, two, three guys are one team, four is one team, five, six are one team. Okay. So there one is belonging to which team? Eight. Two is belonging to which team? Eight. Three is belonging to which team? Eight. So in the team eight, how many number of people are there? Three. 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 4 is belonging to 7. Okay, in 7, how many teams are there? Only 1. In 5, it is belonging to 9. 6, it is belonging to 9. And 9, how many teams are there? 2. So, 2. That is what our output it is. Okay. So, it's very simple. Okay. First of all, let us calculate this as A. Let us call this table as A table. Next, let us calculate B such that for each team ID, how many times it is repeating? Okay. For example, 8, count 3, 7, count 1, 9, 2. So, this will give us for each team ID, how many number of teams are there. Okay. Now, if we connect these two tables using team ID and team ID, we will get the respective employee ID and also team size. That is what we require here. Okay. Very simple. Let me code it up. So S1, S1 is what a uh, employee table dot group by team size calculate the count. So let me keep size as we want it as a table research index. So let me see the S1 first of all. Teams, okay, team ID. Okay, let us give some name here. Name is equal to some count. So each team, how many times it is being repeated, we got it. Now what we need to do, the employee table and the S1 table, I will connect it up. So my step two would be connect the S1 table, S1 table with employee table. How it should be connected? Only matching rows. So inner join. And what are the columns? Left side should be team ID right side is equal to team id let us let us call this as step 2 step 2 let me just see the go okay okay employee okay it should be merge right As we are doing joining of two tables, I need to keep merge. Okay, we got it. But do I require everything? No. What I want? I want only employee ID, comma, team size. Sorry, team ID, not team size. Okay. 
Okay, let me call this CD as team size then. So that there will be no error. That's it. Okay, our initial test case has been passed. Let me check for all the test cases. Okay, our code query has successfully passed all the test cases and we have solved the problem. If you want the code output a code query which I have written here, it will be available in this GitHub web repository. The link will be provided in the description below. And if you are further interested in learning data science, analytics, machine learning, NLP, computer vision and generative AI stuff, please fill in this Google form below. My team will be reaching out to you soon. And if you are preparing for data science interviews, do check out my playlist. It will be greatly helping your interview process. For further questions or doubts regarding the problem which you have solved, please use this hashtag in the comment section. I will try to solve your doubts. Okay. Until then, keep learning guys.